Try Audible Plus risk-free and get access to thousands of titles, including a vast array of audiobooks, podcasts, and originals that span genre, length, and format. Follow the link in the description and start your free trial of Audible Plus today. Since we're doing all this vinegar syndrome talk, oh goodness, let's unbox my halfway to Black Friday um, haul from Vinegar Syndrome. What do you say? By the way, I love this tape that Vinegar Syndrome uses on their boxes. Very nice stuff. All right. Ooh, we got a lot of goodies in there. Got a lot of goodies from the vinegar syndrome. Hey, Jason, what's up, man? Happy 4th of July to you, my friend. All right, so let's get these out and uh, take a look at them. All right, here we go. Oh, they've got them. Are they individually bubble wrapped? Uh, two of them are individually bubble wrapped. So we'll start with those. I can find a spot here on my desk. Ah, Cemetery of Terror. Yes, from the same director who brought us Don't Panic. Oh my God. I've heard really good things about this movie too. Now granted, Don't Panic definitely raise the bar really high. Uh, thanks in large part to the performance of Michael Bischoff and the song at the end. Let's okay. Hold on. I've got to listen to that song. I need it. I need to hear that song. Here we go. Here we go. Just listen to John Michael Bischoff's voice. Oh, Heavenly, heavenly. <laughs> Tangerine Dream Bob, exactly. <laughs> I wouldn't open, I, I wouldn't do that, Nico. You'd probably get arrested. That's what it's all about right there. That is what it's all about. Uh, if John Michael Bischoff is in this, I'm going to plots. Actually, I think, I think, wait a minute. Is John Michael Bischoff in this? I don't think he is. Damn it. Hmm. But Cemetery of Terror by the same director, um, I am definitely, uh, Ruben Galindo Jr. Definitely looking forward to checking out Cemetery of Terror. And I will most likely do a review of this. If you missed my review of Don't Panic, you should check out that review and you definitely need to watch Don't Panic. Um, Sudden Fury, never seen this one, never heard of it. I just heard very good things about it. I believe it came highly recommended by um, Brad Henderson. He tried to save a woman's life and suddenly became the victim. Sudden Fury. Sudden Fury ranks as one of the finest forgotten films to emerge out of Canada's mid-70s tax shelter era. <laughs> awesome. Nice. Yeah, sounds sounds fun. 
Anybody seen Sudden Fury? Sudden Fury is awesome. Sudden Fury is a gem. Nice. Nice. Goblin has nothing on the Don't Panic tune. I think Goblin really, I think they ripped off. Uh, I think they ripped off John Michael Bischoff, to be honest. Um, I think Goblin is a pale comparison to John Michael Bischoff. And you can clearly also hear the influence John Michael Bischoff had on Tangerine Dream. They pretty much ripped him off too. So, Sudden Fury. All right, now we got a big, big batch of stuff here. We've got the Homegrown Horrors Volume 1 box set. Wow, this is a nice box set. Jeez. Really looking forward to checking out Fatal Exam and Winter Beast. I know Winter Beast was um, highly recommended by uh, Brad Henderson also. But let's check out. Oh, wow. They always, Vinegar Syndrome always does such a nice job on their, on their box sets and stuff. So there is Winter Beast. Here is Beyond Dreams Door. Nice artwork on that one, too. And Fatal Exam. Very nice. Yeah, looking forward to checking all these out. Very cool. Again, very nice. Nice, thick, durable heavy duty box, beautiful artwork. It's gorgeous, gorgeous stuff. Fatal exam is two hours long. Hey, Michael, thank you for the $20 super chat, sir. Very, very kind of you. Late birthday present for Jeremy. Thank you very much. And I'm sure Jeremy would thank you too. That $20 will go toward, I'm sure, Taco Bell, Sonic, who knows? But let's see. Fatal Exam is two hours? Good Lord, that's a long, that's, a, that's an epic slasher. Jeez. But thanks again, Michael. I really appreciate that, man. Very kind of you. Uh, love Cemetery of Terror. Jeremy will love Beyond Dreams Door for sure. Really? Okay. Don't expect much from Fatal Exam. Ah, but that's the slasher of the bunch. What about Winter Beast or Beyond Dreams Door? Any love for those? All right, here we go. What else have we got here? Ah, oh, here we go. We have got the, I don't know if I can show this one. Uh... I can show this side for sure. So I got the deadly embrace and let me cover this part up here. Uh, murder weapon, double feature with the slip case. And for those of you who don't know, murder weapon co-stars Eric Freeman. So great artwork on this release. Murder Weapon, Deadly Embrace. I've, I don't think I've ever seen Deadly Embrace. I have seen Murder Weapon. And um, yeah, but just check out that artwork there. Beautiful, beautiful artwork. Yeah. Yes, the Eric Freeman. He's got a hilarious line of dialogue in Murder Weapon also. Just hilarious. Hilarious piece of dialogue. So Murder Weapon and Deadly Embra Embrace <laughs> Double Pack. With the slip, of course. Gotta have the slip. I've heard really good things about this one, so I'm I'm very eager to check this one out. The color with Malcolm McDowell and Madeline Smith. 
I've heard really good things about this one. Got a cool slip cover. If you've seen the collar, let me know. I like Winter Beast, the no budget wonder with stop motion animation and over the top acting. Cool. That sounds good to me. The collar reminds me of the wind from air. Oh, I love the wind. I loved the wind. So that's cool. If it reminded you of the wind. Very nice. The collar is really good. Interesting. Very well acted with a surprise. The collar is a slow burn, but I love it. Mike says it's rubbish. Looking forward to checking it out. The collar. Let's see. What else have we got here? Oh, <laughs> This was another one that I think was um, highly recommended by Brad. The Severed Arm. There's a psycho loose with an axe, his trademark. <laughs> Check out the back of the slip. Five victims cannot stop him, cannot escape the slashing fury, the sound of terror. Anybody seen The Severed Arm? Really nice slipcase on this one, too. Really nice slipcase. Do I know about the movie Halloween? Is that the one with the guy with pins in his head? Is that, I've heard that one's pretty good. Or the, the, with the, they called him Needlehead or something. Right? <laughs> but the severed arm. Uh, let's see what else. Oh, last one. Oh, whoa, that, this, this is a nice slip. Holy crap. Necromancer. Yeah. It's the back of the slip. It's got like a bottom loading slip. And holy crap. This slip case is like really thick. And holy crap. You could knock somebody out with this thing. It's got a poster with it as well. But, uh, yeah, Elizabeth Caton. I love Elizabeth Caton. Is there an interview with Elizabeth Caton on here? No, unfortunately not. That sucks. But still looking forward to seeing Necromancer. When simple revenge is not enough. And then the back of it, demonic forces from the depths of hell. see what's up with the poster here is the poster the one with yeah okay so with the poster is basically that artwork so that was my that was actually three different orders because <laughs> i ordered a bunch and then of course i went back and i was like uh, maybe i should have got that one too so i ordered and then i went back a third time and went ah, i'll just get that too why not so uh, Necromancer is totally happening in a far out way. Nice, Pam Paul. Nice. She's a babe. Elizabeth Caton is, yeah, she's a babe. No doubt about that. She was also in Silent Night, Deadly Night 2 with Eric Freeman. And of course, uh, Friday the 13th, The New Blood. That one was slow, but she makes it enjoyable. Good. Don't show the slip to the guys and gals over at Region Free. Well, listen, this slip case, Lorne would need a saw of some kind to rip through. Because this thing is like, this slip is, I'm not even joking. Very, very tough. Very thick. Oh, I've got number 3,662 out of 4,000. Cool. By the way, I think ripping slipcases is blasphemy, and I think it's a crime that deserves crucifixion. That's just me. So that's my Vinegar Syndrome Halfway to Black Friday haul, Cemetery of Terror. Can't wait to check out Cemetery of Terror. Sudden Fury. Sounds like a really fun movie. Got the Homegrown Horrors Volume 1 box set. Looking forward to checking those out. Got the Murder Weapon and Deadly Embrace double pack. 
Got to cover up uh, Ms. Quigley's butt there on the murder weapon side of the sleeve. Uh, got the collar. Looking forward to checking out the collar. Uh, got the severed arm. Sounds like some mixed feelings about severed arm in the chat, but looking forward to checking it out also. Thanks again, Piz, for the great William Lustig bloodstream show. Thank you, Nico. That was a fun one. That was a really fun one. And Necromancer. A huge shout out to all my patrons and channel members. I appreciate your generosity and support of my channel. Become a patron today and join me for exclusive live streams, get early access to videos, and have a say in what movies I review on my channel. Become a channel member and get access to exclusive badges and emotes to use when I stream. Links are in the description. Say hello to the internet, Jeremy. Hello to the internet.